Gemini 2.5 flash image model is nano bananas. I think everybody has been going bananas with this model. This is one of the best image editing model that is available right now. And I'm going to take you through a series of prompts and you're going to be fascinated about how great this model is. The shame is that we don't have technical details about what is the size of the parameter, how Google trained it. I mean, obviously this is an IP that they wouldn't want to share, but this is the best image generation model. Unlike ELO rating on LM Arena, this model is like way above the second best model. And the model is 10 times cheaper than OpenAI's image generation model. So for developers, for consumers, for anybody who wants to try out something like Photoshop, but that is magical and this model is exactly that model. To start with, I've got this model on AI Studio. So you can go to Google AI Studio and then on the top right hand corner, you can select the model. So Gemini 2.5 Flash image preview is available as you can see here under the featured model. This is a new model. This is the Nano Bananas model and this can do two things. One, image generation and image editing. So I can select the model and I've given this image of Scarlett Johansson and then I've given the mug from OpenAI just to solve the uh, bring peace between OpenAI and Scarlett Johansson. So I said, please make a mug commercial with a beautiful background where the woman is holding uh, the mug while resting. And this is the output image I've got, like how beautiful this image is with a beautiful scenery in the background with the same woman I have given and the mug literally she's holding. And it's not like we have got six fingers or anything like weird, like stable diffusion days. And this is pretty fascinating. There are a lot of things that you can do with this. One, obviously you can go ahead and then generate an image. Like for example, I can create a new chart here and I can say, select the model, make sure you select the model, create two stick figures arguing about super intelligence. Make sure to add some color pop. Hop. Send this and the model is pretty fast. So you can see it's generating the image. So you can see that it has generated the image and this is like two stick figures arguing super AI evolution, but create two stick figures. More like a comic strip that argues about super intelligence. Make sure to have white background and the stick figures black in color. That's it. Send this. And then the model is pretty fast. It's not like, you know, it is going to take a lot of time. If you have used chat GPT open AS model, then you can see that it is going to take a lot of time. I'm going to give the same request to chat GPT. So I've got uh, the new chat and I'm going to just go here and then say, create to stick, create an image of, okay. I'm going to send this and you're going to see how much time this is going to take. This is going to take fairly a long time. It started generating the image and Google AI Studio is done. Super intelligence is too dangerous. It might destroy us accident. Like with just literally this, you can launch a startup where you can take human request and then create a comic strip. And this model is really, really good with prompt adherence. Okay. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to just take Jack Dorsey, Jack Dorsey. Okay. Uh, I'm going to get the pick of Jack Dorsey, copy the image, go back here, paste it. And I'm going to give a long prompt that I've got. This prompt is going to be used to make Jack Dorsey into a YouTube thumbnail. And uh, this basically is trying to make Jack Dorsey sell pipe coding. If you don't know, we have already tried Jack Dorsey's goose and uh, something that I love a lot. Unfortunately, I've got a terrible Mac now. I can't try out goose more. So you can see I've uploaded this image. Uh, all I want is like a thumbnail where it says pipe coding. Okay, um, this is not what I expected. Like last time it was different. It looks like the model has failed me. So I'm going to go here, paste it again. Make sure the model doesn't fail me this time. Let us see if it again fails me. Meanwhile, we have gone back to OpenAI, which is still not finished. I mean, it says getting started. I don't know if something is wrong. So OpenAI's image generation, as much as it is cool, I've been using it for a while, but it is a lot of mess. Um, okay, this is great. So see, we have got a YouTube thumbnail. And uh, we can see that uh, $1 million wipe coding. Okay. What if I want to add, let's say a bunch of icons. I don't want to go get uh, icons from stock library. So I'm going to say, can you add some uh, Twitter, Facebook, uh, VS code icons there? Um, I, I just add a red color uh, um, grid background similar to popular YouTube thumbnails. So the good thing about this model is you can have a natural language conversation and then just like do whatever you want. So as you can see here, we have uploaded Jack Torsi's image just like in one prompt, zero shot prompt, we got something like this. 
and if you're interested in the prompt let me know i can add it in the description but then you can go ask for follow up so this is like the typical youtube style i've uh, asked it to do it and then i've added it it doesn't have visual studio code i think it added the twitter it added the facebook icon and then just like that we have everything cool now i'm going to show you how you can use it for product placement so i'm going to use jack dorsey again we already saw it with scarlett johnson i'm going to just paste jack dorsey here and let's get a perfume bottle perfume bottle i've copied the screenshot go back here and uh, please make an ad where this man in is uh, holding this perfume in a glamorous pose in hawaii I don't know, some random thing i'm giving but you would probably get the point so you can see there is a perfume brand and there is a man and it is all zero shot. We are not doing LoRa. We are not using any sort of plugin. This is literally Gemini 2.5. Oh my goodness. I didn't expect this. Look at this. Look at, look at this. I mean, like, look at this. The letters even are not very distorted. Like you can, you can actually see, I mean, like the, the font, I mean, if you closely observe, you might look at something, but this is insane. I mean, I can't believe that this happened. Like, for example, now I can just. Can you add a beautiful, uh, beautiful um, Caucasian girlfriend next to this man and just hugging him? Okay. I hope we are not violating any content policy. Please don't, uh, don't, don't flag me. Um, YouTube or Google AI Studio. I'm just trying to be educational here. So we have success. Oh, look. <laughs> <laughs> honestly i mean like this is this is insane i mean like i can't i can't understand like um you know i can't imagine like how many people's life would be ruined with this but i mean look at this just like couple of commands we managed to do this i mean um can you um add some beautiful hair on the man's head um just to be very clear um i mean like the woman already has so let's see, I mean, the hairstyle, what if, you know, people don't like the hairstyle. And it, though, I think the only gripe that I have about Gemini 2.5 Flash um, is I think it is mostly generating square images. Um, but in this case, it's generating like a 9 by 16. Wow. <laughs> I mean, my man has got, um, uh, yeah, there is, there is uh, some sort of text. There is always this watermark there, but look at the hair. I mean, uh, he looks cute, isn't he? And um, what if, um, can you... Uh, remove the background completely and uh, make it green in color. So if you want to use it with chroma key, then you can just simply go ahead and then do it. And I mean, with this demo itself, you would have probably seen, let's go back to chat GPT and uh, see if, uh, oh my goodness, did I close chat GPT? Yep, uh, no, I have got, okay. Chat GPT has not um, done something bad. I, I, I appreciate what it has created. Super intelligence is coming soon. No, it won't. Uh, but um, yeah, that's it. It's it's good, but uh, I would I would still say like the speed in which Gemini 2.5 Flash Preview is delivering. I think it's completely insane. People can. The good thing about this model is like um, you can generate multiple frames and then use it with something like Kling with the first frame and last frame, and you can generate an entire video. So there are a lot of things that are interesting about this model, but I want to stop this video here and then give you the opportunity. To go try out this model, you can try out this model on aistudio.google.com or ea.studio and go select Gemini 2.5 Flash. Only thing is you've got rate limit on which you have to deal with. But otherwise, this is a great, great release from Google and entire Google team is going bananas with bananas. Emoticons internet, but uh, this is a great model. But I really hope Chinese models will come and catch up with this models very soon. See you in another video. Happy prompting.